And now, from Fox 55 News, this is your local sports. Hey, good evening, everyone. Well, starting tomorrow, it's win or go home for high school football teams all across the state of Indiana, and you won't find many games better than the one taking place in Turtle Town. It's a first-round sectional showdown between unbeaten Southwood and Churubusco in the locker room's game of the week, and Peter Hood is here to get you ready for it. Prince, every year this is one of the best small school sectionals in the state, and this season's no exception. Three teams ranked in the top ten in Class 1A, including both Busco and Southwood, and something's got to give with this matchup. The Eagles' offense has been flying high all season, averaging over 36 points per game, but they'll have their work cut out for them against tonight's defense that's surrendering less than a touchdown per contest. I think their speed overall on defense is not something that we've seen. Uh, we're going to have to find a way to slow them down, and, 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 and I mean that our offense is going to have to find a way to slow their defense down in order for us to have any success. Well, up front, we have to get off the ball. They all get off the ball with aggression, and they come upfield, so we'll just have to block up front, and hopefully our uh, skilled players can make some plays. It's definitely going to be a good matchup, but I think we can have the pieces to really move the ball, and then we can find the weak spots and really take advantage of that. Their running back's pretty tough, runs the ball a lot, runs the ball hard. We just got a gang tackle. Stop him, stop them. Uh, they're a downhill running team. They're going to try to run it down our throats. Um, we faced a lot of teams like that this year, and uh, I think we'll be ready for them. If you want to move forward in the, in the tournament, you got to play somebody good. So whether you get a Cherubusco early or Cherubusco, I mean, you're going to have to beat them at some point. So I just soon get them first game. And I mean, if we're not worthy, then we're going to find out early. You know, obviously our sectional is tough. And if we're going to have a chance to not only win our sectional, but even even advance, uh, we're going to have to play our best football. And we think we're capable of doing that. But but uh, it's, uh, you know, if half the teams are going to be done tomorrow night, and we don't want to be one of them. But we know that in order to accomplish that, we're going to have to do, play pretty good football. Kickoff here in Turtletown set for 7 p.m. tomorrow night. Don't forget, though, late kickoff for the locker room. We're on after the World Series, so stay up after the game and join Jay Prince and I for some late night sectional football fun. Hashtag Fox 55 after dark. Looking forward to it. And here's uh, just some of what we got in store for you tomorrow night in classes 1A and 2A. An intriguing matchup in sectional 35 with Woodland hosting Eastside. And in class 4A, we've got a couple big time rematches with DeKalb hosting Columbia City and Angola traveling to take on Leo. Again, all of that and more for you tomorrow night after game three of the World Series.